Hey guys, it's Lolly coming back at you with another drawing video. Sorry we haven't uploaded in almost a year. Wow. We were all kind of busy with the show doing our whole theater kid thing. Today I'm doing a miraculous ladybug drawing. Now don't go beyond this point um, if you haven't watched the Time Tiger episode. They gone? Okay, good. Uh, alright, so I'm drawing future Hawk Moth, or who I think is going to be future Hawk Moth. So, for those of you who haven't watched Time Tiger but don't really care about spoilers, it is basically revealed in that episode that in the future, um, Gabriel Rest won't be Hawk Moth anymore. And Basically, there's a lot of speculation about who Hawk Moth will be. Some people think that it'll be Natalie or something. Well, I think it's going to be Lila Rossi. I hate Lila Rossi as much as I hate Luganette. Okay, back off Luganette shippers because even Master Fu ships Adrianette. And I'm not one to doubt Master Fu. And you shouldn't doubt him either. Sorry, just had to insert a miraculous opinion that nobody asked for. Anyway, I have a lot of reasons for thinking that Lila will take Gabriel's place. Well, first of all, he's kind of, like, I guess, taken her under his moth wing. <laughs> Sorry, that was extremely evil of me. I apologize. Uh, there's some people yelling outside. Sorry if you can hear them. Anyway, Hawk Moth has seen how manipulative she truly is. And I feel like he would probably want her to take his place. Some people are saying that Natalie will actually become Hawk Moth and that Lila will take her place as Mayura, but do you really think that, I guess, Lila would accept her position as sidekick? Nah. It is kind of a possibility though, because both of them do have like the motivation to become Hawk Moth. Only, Lyra's is a little more petty, honestly. You know, Natalie is all like, I love Gabriel Agrast, so I'm going to carry out his wish. You know, and Lila is all like, you know, Ladybug embarrassed me in front of Adrian once, so like, I hate her. But, you know, that's just my opinion. Now you can see around here that I did have a little trouble doing the mask, but I got it eventually. Also, I feel like Lila's outfit would be a little more girly, um, because, you know, the outfit depends on the miraculous soldier. And also I'm giving her little pigtails to kind of stick out of her hawk moth helmet. Kind of like how they do around her bangs. Now ignore the copy and pasting of the Akuma. Um, I did this drawing earlier, I swear this is not somebody else's drawing. Um, and I just had an Akuma lying around so why the hell not. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching!